some people who are musicians or some people who uh, like to sing, they write uh, songs. They said the Lord gave them the song. He gives them the music. And there's a difference between secular music and holy music. Satan wanted to be like God. So he has his own music. And the music that they're making now that are secular sounds nothing like the holy music. There are music, musical um, items, musical instruments in heaven. This is where it began. This is in Genesis uh, chapter 4. And Lamech, which is Noah's dad, took to, unto him two wives. And this is during the time Seth was still living, uh, Methuselah was still living, because uh, they lived like hundreds of years. He took two wives. The name of the one was Ada, and the name of the other, Zillah. And Ada bare J Jabel. Jabel, he was the father of such as dwell in tents. Jabel, this is where the making of the tents are. Who taught him? First of all, we have to remember when God created Adam and Eve, he gave them the, the, the knowledge. Um, they, they learned between good and evil, but he gave them the knowledge through his seed. And they learned how to make these instruments. And God inspired. He put these thoughts in their head. So he was a maker of tents. And it says, and of such as had cattle. And his brother's name was Jubal. He was the father of all such as handled the harp and organ. They thought the organ was re recently made in the last 100, 200 years. This goes all the way back, way before your grandfather's grandfathers. He made the harp and the organ. Okay. Um, Satan, like I said, hey, I don't, I don't praise Satan, but we have to know the truth. David, all the way up to David, David made a harp. David made a harp, and he was very skilled in it. It was a gift, a gift from God. That's why you have some people who learn how to play by ear, because that is a gift. Um, in heaven, let's just go to Revelation real quick. Uh, chapter 15, verse 2. And I saw, as it were a sea of glass mingled with fire, and them that had gotten the victory, victory over the beast and over his image and over his mark and over the number of his name stand uh, uh, on the sea of glass having the harps of God. So they had harps in heaven. They had tambourines in heaven. They sang in heaven. Let's go to um, Ezekiel 28. First of all, uh, it begins in talking about the uh, the king of Tyrus. The, uh, how the king of Tyrus was, how it explains, is saying this is how Satan was. Because that spirit was in him of Satan. Satan could not rule. Uh, and, and, and this is why war broke out. You know, um, lion was in heaven from him. Uh, he was accuser of the brethren. Fighting, hate, angry. And then we have this on earth. And when um, people that, are, that don't have the, the, the spirit of God, music comes through Satan through people who are not godly. They have this certain beat that's appealing to a lot of people. And so you can't worship God in Satan's music. Even though it sounds good to you, that's what he does. He is skilled in music. I'm not going to say he directed a choir. I know a lot of people say that, but he was over, he was in the music. He was. And this is where the music come from, Satan. Okay. Ezekiel 28, verse 12. Son of man, take up a lamentation upon the king of Tyrus and say unto him, thus said the Lord God, thou sealest up the sum full of wisdom and perfect in beauty. So we, let's say we're talking about him, but um, and he may have been, per but there's, all, there's only one that God made perfect in wisdom, great in wisdom, and that's Satan. Okay, so now, this king, uh, since Satan couldn't rule in heaven, he said, well, I'm going to get in someone, and I'm going to rule. So, when he gets into people, and they are deceitful, and they're, they're stealing, and, and, and riches, and 
wisdom of being a king or wicked king, Satan, demons or whatever they use them. But so whatever this king, this king was wicked, but it begins to talk to Satan that was in him or this spirit that was in him. 13, thou hast been in Eden, the garden of God. So, you know, uh, when some per a person act up and people say, you're acting like the devil or uh, some people are possessed with the devil. That means it took over. So it's taken over by a spirit. So the spirit was in this king of Cyrus, in the gold Tyrus. So now it goes to s telling us how Satan was and what happened to Satan because it, it, um, it says this. It goes down below. This talks about, because um, I had someone say, well, that's about the king. Was the king a cherub? Okay, because this is what it's going to say. Thou hast been in Eden, the garden of God. Every precious stone was thy covering, the sardis, topaz, and the diamond, and the beryl, and ox, and the jasper, the sapphire, the emerald, and the uh, carbuncle, and gold, the workmanship of thy tabret, those are tamarines, those are, uh, or you can decorate it like that, and they dance, like even uh, the children of Israel, they dance with the timbrel. Um, and of thy pipes. Now, we're not talking about a pipe. Now, what is he going to do with just a plain pipe? Everything in heaven was of, like, beauty. Gold, sardis, and things like this. And why would God have a pipe? The pipe, the playing of the pipe, whether it be a flute. What else kind of instruments did they have in heaven? We're not talking about all on earth. In heaven, they had the trumpet, just like they have down here. Everybody think, uh, well, some people feel that all the instruments were made here. It was inspired from heaven. All these in 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 uh, instruments are in heaven. The organ, just because it doesn't mention this, uh, like particular ones like drums, you know that they had the beat and everything. Um, and this is what it is. I had a relative tell me one time to say this real quick because people always said, well, that's not in the Bible. It didn't say anything about drums. God gives us wisdom. If you smoke a cigarette and the package says warning hazardous to your health can cause cancer. You are defiling the temple of God. The Bible says, uh, God said, if you defile my temple, which is your body, your body, you will, I destroy does it say cigarette? Because this relative says cigarettes not in the Bible. Come on now, be specific. I mean, be real. Um, I mean, you are being specific, but let's get real. A lot of words that are used now is not in there. Marijuana is not in there. Weed is not in there, but we know what it does. It's the same thing. It's defiling the temple. So if organs and everything was made from the beginning of time, even though it's not set up like it was, it began from heaven. Do I believe there's an organ in heaven? Of course. How can you have tambourine, a tambour, a tabret, a pipe, a trumpet, a harp, and don't have anything else? Okay. So there was a lot of strings instruments. There was singing. There was music in heaven. There was dancing in heaven. The angels danced. Okay. And all these, like sapphires, emerald, and all these things, doesn't that remind you of, of when God uh, gave Aaron um, the uh, as uh, the the word the ephod, and they had the all those same uh, jewels representing the twelve tribes, I, I believe. So why does Satan? He was covered with that. He had these things. Thou art the anointed cherub. Was he talking about King Tyrus? No. Thou art the anointed cherub that covereth the soul. I put you there. Thou wast upon the holy mountain of God. Thou hast walked up and down in the midst of the stones of fire. Thou wast perfect in thy ways from the day that thou wast created till iniquity was found in thee. By the multitude of thy merchandise, you have so many, they have filled the midst of thee with violence. You had violence. You have sinned. Therefore, I will cast thee as profane out in the mountain of God. So you walked on 
fire. Now the same fire you walked on is going to consume you. I will destroy thee, O covering cherub, from the midst of the stones of fire. Thine heart was lifted up because of thy beauty. Thou hast corrupt thy wisdom by reason of thy brightness. I will cast thee to the ground. I will lay thee before kings that they may behold thee. Thou hast defiled thy sanctuaries by the multitude of thine iniquities. And that is pearl. Wow. By the iniquity of thy traffic. Therefore will I bring forth a fire from the midst of thee. And it shall devour thee. At the end he will be cast. And I will bring thee to ashes upon the earth in the sight of all them that behold thee. He is the music person in heaven. He was one of the ones who did play. Did he dance before the Lord at one time? Of course. Angels dance before the Lord. They still praise God. The strongest angel, one of the strongest angels in war, Michael. They dance. Gabriel, who stands on the right hand of God. They worship him. They get on their knees. They worship him. There is music in heaven. So this, you know what really gets me, and I'm going to say this quick before this, um, I had to say this, because it just seems like a lot of men, and I'm not going to say all of them, but it seems like uh, many of them, every time they teach, they teach in error. They, when, when you have leaders that are supposed to be over you, really they're supposed to be a servant to you. But see, we're caught up, like Jesus said, they're caught up in, um, uh, in their title, in ranks. And, um, instead of serving, they want to be held on high. They want to be on top. Jesus said that let the highest be the servant. And so these bishops, and these elders have people working for them. Uh, it's nothing wrong with bringing water to them or whatever, but that's what they expect. Do my feet, um, uh, do this for me, make runs, and, uh, and they don't do not one thing when they're supposed to be on that uh, sending uh, people out. You're supposed to be serving too. Everybody supposed to be serving uh, that's working towards the kingdom. You're a leader, you become the servant, you teach your the ones under you to how to be a servant. But you, they don't serve you. You show them how to serve. because, And then when you start, show them how to serve, and then they become a leader. They show others how to serve. And then everybody's working in the kingdom. But um, Lucifer, now Satan, is the maker of the secular, the underworld. That type of music is not godly music. And it is wrong to be caught up in that is either you go heaven heavenly music or hell music and it's nothing more because when god makes music he makes it to worship him he makes things to worship him um and satan did play a few instruments so far what it named it named the the, the um the pipes and pipes can be uh, what we have now. We have flutes. We have whatever other kind of pipes they call. Uh, there's different types of pipes. Trumpets. Harps. He had the tamra. Okay? So music came from heaven. Instruments came from heaven. God inspired man. That he gave them the knowledge to make these instruments. And we got, regardless how many. If there's different types of organs when you uh, look it up. They start little to big to big, but they're still stringed organs, okay? So I just want to uh, top that off on them saying that, um, and I read that to show that uh, the pipes uh, is the instrument, musical instrument, as they were trying to say. And the pipes is not an instrument. It is. What else was it? Something metal? I don't think so. In heaven? How did David learn how to make a harp? Through... His ancestors and how the jubil make the harp. It was inspired by God. Okay, so um, Satan has his type of music. He's still trying to rule, and um, he's got a lot of people's heart. So um, he's still working until that day that he will be consumed.
right? 